Okay, here's the deal. It's time to shop my stash again. I really need to go through some stuff, figure out what I need to use up, and figure out some foundations that might match me because I've been going outside. So yeah, if you want to see me show my stash, then just keep watching. I like to do this the old fashioned way because I got my setup here. So I'm going to go to my little phony phone and let's see what I need to use up. Okay guys, here's the deal. I'm still on the process of working through some of the products that I picked from my last Shop My Stash. MAC Paint Pot, still staying. I have a little bit of this oil left from Good Molecules. I need to use that. Trying to use up this e.l.f. Camo Concealer. Still trying to use up this No Pore Blend Primer. I did use a pretty good amount though. Still trying to use up this Rose Glycerin Water Spray. Excuse me, Rose Water and Glycerin Spray. Still trying to use this up. I use this every single day and I can't believe I haven't hit pan on it yet. Still trying to use this and really debating if I'm just going to move it over to my declutter because I have started to hit pan on these. So that's exciting. I think I'm going to use it a little bit longer because of the bronzer. But once I see a little bit more pan on the bronzer, I think I'm going to let it go. Still trying to work through this, but I have, I have really made progress. Look at that. Wow. Then I really haven't even reached for this since I put it out here. So I got a lot, I got a lot to do on that. Okay. Now that we know where we stand. Ooh. Now that we know where we stand with that stuff, let's look through the drawers. Lipsticks, I never really worry about. I'm fine with just using those as I please. Concealers, I'm just gonna stick with that e.l.f. one until I use it. And I already have three powders out, so sorry powders. You are all gonna have to stay right where you're at. And also, primer situation, it has grown a little bit. Um, yeah, these are probably going to stay exactly where they're at. I might put this one on the desk. I keep forgetting to uh, moisturize in the morning. So I think I'm just going to leave this on the desk so that way I just can use this as my moisturizer. Now foundations. This is where it gets tricky because I am a lot tanner than uh, years past. So there's a lot of things in here that will not even remotely match me right now. Um, so I really should buy a summer shade if I was being realistic, but instead I'm just going to bronze the heck out of my skin because I'm refusing to buy any more foundation right now. I got goals, okay? Um, I am going to pull this one out. It's a little bit on the tanner side. This one doesn't look like it, but it does seem to warm up on my skin. Um, I'm oxidized, that's the word I'm looking for. So I'm gonna put this one out. And this one. This one's definitely tanner. What year did I get you? Let me get this you away. 2018. See, I really want to work through the ones that are two years old because it's older than it should be. So man, man, oh, this one matches me so good right now. At least compared to anything else I have. Oh, man. Okay. I think I'm gonna pull all three because maybe I'll just do a little concoction, you know, to try to use them up. I would think these should get me through the rest of summer. Let's see, this is a new addition for um, an e.l.f. video I just did. Like I said, I'm still using, like I said, I'm still using that bronzer. Do I want to pull any of this out yet? I'm not going to put it out on the desk yet, but as soon as I put the, as soon as I put the pure in my declutter, I'm going to pull out the shade and light. That will be the next one to use because I've had it the longest and I have used it before. These other ones, I haven't even opened yet. Blush, not really worried about it. I, I'm fine with keeping blush for like ever. I don't know why. These still gonna work through that rose water and this one. I have been so bad about reaching for a setting spray now that it's hot out. I don't know why, but I really need to start using that. Mascara, I only have two right now, so 
So I'm comfortable leaving these in here. I'm not gonna open any more until I go through these. And one primer. As far as brows go, I do think I'm going to pull out these two. This one I've had for just a little bit, the LA Colors. And I actually bought this liquid liner to use for like little hair-like strokes. So I think I'm gonna set both of these out. That's all gonna stay put. Highlighters, I really have not been reaching for highlighters like at all, ever anymore. I don't know what's wrong with me. I'm just, I don't know, I'm just like over it, uh, which is terrible. But anyway, so these are all gonna stay put. Same with these. The one eyeshadow palette I do wanna use up is this. I've made a lot of progress on it recently because I've actually just been using these for my brows a lot, the browns. And I, I'm almost out of that one. And honestly, I'm probably just gonna declutter this one pretty soon. I'm going away for a couple days, so I might take this with me. And then uh, after that trip, I'll probably just get rid of it. Is there anything else out and about that I feel like I need to really focus on? I need to focus on not buying any more stuff. The only thing is I'm looking through my collection. I just did a recent e.l.f. haul, a small one, and I did a small ColourPop haul. So I have added a few things to my collection. Uh, I really don't need to buy any more makeup. I know I say that all the time, yet I still buy some. Uh, I have room for improvement, but I have definitely stopped buying a lot compared to years past. But the one thing I feel like I'm missing is like a gel navy blue eyeliner. That is like the one. I need like a deep blue and maybe a turquoise. So <laughs> while I'm out of town, if I do a little shopping, I might look for those two things. But I'm going to cut myself off at that. Nothing else. Nothing else. Okay, you guys, that is uh, a little glimpse at my collection. Let's run through what I picked real fast. The primary moisturizer, because like I said, I've been really bad about remembering to moisturize after I wash my face in the morning. So this will be so handy to have on the desk to remind me to moisturize. Still working on that paint pot. Still working on this bad boy. I mean, this thing is really, there's a lot of product in there. The ColourPop Blur Powder, I'm, after this trip, I'm probably gonna put this in my completed pile because it's, it's basically done. Um, I really think in a few, like another week, I will basically be through that. And then this one, probably after this trip also, it'll be going because I've had this since 2018, a really long time, and I'm trying to get rid of things that were from 2018 that are like complexion products. The Femi powder is gonna be sitting here. I probably will not be reaching that until I get through these other two powders, just to be real with you guys. I'm gonna use this Huda Beauty palette on my little mini trip, and then probably going to also declutter it because the one thing I will say is these eyeshadows are so pigmented. And they work really well, but they give me so much fallout on the face and that usually doesn't bother me but it's like really bad and really hard to get off for some reason like it has messed up my complexion more than once using this thing the primer still have a lot of room to go on that like today I didn't even wear a primer I've been kind of bad about like primer setting spray and highlighters I just haven't been reaching for those products I think it's just because it's hot out I'm gonna keep using my little f cam f elf Camo concealer, this is like an all-time fave. I only have like this much left, I'm almost done, yay! The three foundations I'm gonna be trying to make some concoctions out of to use these up because two of them I've had since 2018. The, this one is only a year old, so that's not like horrible, depending on what your idea of horrible is. <laughs> and I've had these two since 2018. So I'm gonna be mixing these three together, the Born This Way, the Confidence in a Foundation, and the Jouer, and trying to use some bronzer to make it match. I think that's all for today. All right guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you smash that subscribe button and join the Lash Fam. And as always, please, 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 please try to stay positive because now more than ever, it is so needed because at the end of the day, that is truly all we can try to do. Thank you so much for watching. Have a wonderful day.